Hi everyone. Today we're going to make a one minute chocolate chip cookie in a mug, but we're going to use this. I'm going to use a ramekin. Uh, I didn't have a, a mug that had a wide uh, dimension to it. This is about seven ounces or 200 milliliters if you're in metric. And I've never made one before. So we're going to do it together and see what happens. So we start off with melted butter in the ramekin. Um, my microwave's really tiny. So I had to melt it for about 50 seconds. You don't want the butter to burn. Then we're going to add in the sugars. A tablespoon of white sugar a tablespoon of brown sugar. I had light brown sugar on hand, but that's okay. The vanilla extract, that's only half a teaspoon. And then just a pinch. So we're gonna mix that up. And I'm using a fork, but I have a spoon uh, on hand as well because We'll need the spoon at the end to kind of smooth the top down. So now we're going to mix in the egg yolk. Just want to make sure I get all that egg yolk out of there. And I'm going to use my spoon to mix this. Because you really want to mix the egg into the mixture very well. So now we add three tablespoons of flour. And I think I'll go back to the fork. I spilled some flour. <laughs> I always make a mess. When my husband Mark comes home, he said, oh, Judy's been baking. That's okay, right? I used to edit out all those messes, but that's not real life. Okay. So now we want two tablespoons of chocolate chips. And what I've done is I've mixed them. I've got dark chocolate chips and milk chocolate chips. So good. And they just need to be folded in. And then we'll just smooth that down. And then, of course, we need a few more chocolate chips, right? Just put them, you can poke them in, or leave them on top. That's it. So now we're going to uh, cook it in the microwave for 60 minutes. I have a small microwave and I think it might be five or 600 watts. So I'm going to do that on medium and I'll be right back. Oh my gosh, it's absolutely perfect. So I used uh, the power level six on my little microwave for 66 seconds. Um, maybe if I'd used power level seven, then I would have only needed 60 seconds. So that really proves that you need to kind of test your own microwave. So now that it's cooled a little bit, let's have a taste test. Look at all that rich chocolate. Mmm, look at all that delicious chocolate. Okay, so let's have a taste test. Mmm, so much chocolate, so good. I love the blend of the dark and milk chocolate chips. The cookie. Don't talk with your mouth full, Judy. The cookie 
is completely cooked inside. There's no gooiness, but the chocolate is where, uh, the melted chocolate is where the gooiness is. I would definitely make this again, um, you know, maybe in the evenings when we're watching hockey and we really have a craving for something sweet or whatever you need to uh, get your chocolate fix. Uh, I think the next time I make it, I'm going to put a little drop of Nutella in the center or maybe just a piece of solid chocolate and see if that gives like a lava-like center to it, like a lava cake. That's what I put in my Nutella stuffed skillet cookie. So if you haven't seen that recipe, be sure to check it out. Thanks for baking with me today. I had a lot of fun. I hope you did too. Really good.